So can everybody hear me okay with this mic on? Yeah? You guys can hear me? Okay, great. So I wanted to ask you first what this is. Can anybody tell me? All right, you dear. Water, okay, and what do we do with water? Go ahead. You drink it, but what else do you do? Go ahead. Feed plants, and what else? You girls want to take a guess? What do you do when you get dirty? Go ahead. You wash yourselves, that's right. So, go ahead, Fleetwood. It grown a lot because you watered it, right? But when we get dirty, we wash ourselves. And so today, we're going to have a baptism in Fleetwood Sister Aspen. And what happens in a baptism is everybody makes mistakes, and we call that sin. We are doing something that God doesn't want us to do. And when you're baptized, you're washed, your sins are washed away. And there's a story about John the Baptist, and he wore this um, camel hair um, camel hair vest and he lived out in the desert and, and John was baptizing people in the river and Jesus came to be baptized by John but Jesus didn't have any sins but yet Jesus wanted to show everybody what to do so he came and got baptized by John too now we're not going to be baptizing Aspen in the river today you guys want to come up and take a look at what our baptismal clock looks like come on up So that's what it looks like. There's a little bit of water in there, and I'm going to take that water and I'm going to put it on her head, and I'm going to say some words. I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, because that's what Jesus told us to do. And then her sins are washed away. Now, we all continue to make mistakes, so we have to continually ask for forgiveness, but that is to show that now she is a child of God. And we're going to do all of this later in the service, but I wanted to make sure you guys understood what was happening later, and I'm sure you probably wanted to see it up close, so I wanted to make sure you could see what it looked like up close. Now, some people do it in the river, some people do it in this big tank that's like a pool, some people take a little sprinkling thing and sprinkle it on you, but today I'm just going to be wiping the back of her head with it. And so, we want to thank God that he allows us to become one of his children and be washed clean, so we're going to say a quick prayer now, okay? So you can all stand here and we'll pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for the opportunity to be have our sins washed clean and to have Jesus uh, and welcome us into his family. We ask that you help us to grow in your grace and truth and, and be watered and grow big like the plant that Leewood told us about. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Now there is an opportunity to go for Sunday school if you'd like. And Bar Miss Barbara here would go along with um, with Miss Heather. So if you'd like to go, you're welcome to go. Otherwise, you can go back and sit with your parents, okay? They have a lesson plan for you if you'd like. Oh, yes, and you won't miss the baptism. We'll make sure that you come back for the baptism and then you'll stay with your parents, all right? So you don't have to sit through my sermon. But that's up to you. Okay, guys. You, you, on the other hand, do have to sit through it. I have a good story.